Hey there, everybody. Are those here from Ice Games? Bring you episode 91 of my Guild Wars 2 Necromancer Let's Play with Van Lessa here. Uh, here we are, still in or finishing up with the uh, the main storyline quest here. Gosh, it's it's been a long journey, but an amazing one. Ah, uh, must be like like three, two or three episodes, of, or th two or three missions away from the uh, the final mission there, Aphonic. I think you were the one uh, letting me know which ones were coming up or how how many numbers i have not which ones but uh numbered left but uh coming up on the end here which is super awesome also want to uh apologize a little bit about, a little bit about last week uh i think i missed uh, an episode or two i think my char revenant uh and like uh, i think some of my total war stuff and uh missed playing with you guys on saturdays i uh was a little um little worse for the wear. Uh, I got some carpal tunnel acting up on me. Uh, what if the doctor got a nice little uh, brace thing to, to wear for the next little while? Hopefully it doesn't get much worse because I don't want to be out for a couple months because that would really suck. Uh, I love playing my video games too much to not play them for a couple months. <laughs> Either way, guys, don't worry. I'll take care of myself. Um, but uh, speaking of, uh, of you guys, you guys gave me some awesome, awesome comments last month, uh, last episode. Um, so Afonic was saying the mechanic where I use the cannons and the shield to reflect the rocks and ships uh, away from the ships is very important and something I have to remember. So a little bit of foreshadowing. So I, I got to remember the that that uh, mechanic, which is actually a really cool mechanic. I know it's I've had the mechanic before and I keep screwing it up, but I think I finally got it. Finally got it last episode when we were uh, deflecting those dead fish and then and deflecting the rocks from those giants. So thank you, Phonic. Thank you for the foreshadowing. I'll try to try to make sure I remember that. Um, um, Banjo Joe Dots, you're asking about the PvP video. I do have it coming up. I apologize. I know I've been saying that every episode. But like I'll totally be having it soon. Um, I keep I keep screwing up the way I'm editing it and uh, recording it. Um, mainly because when I get so many people playing it, uh, I'll think it's recording fine. I'll record a little bit fine, and all of a sudden the audio is really messed up on it. Um, so that's that's kind of the main reason why. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm keep playing. Uh, I'll, I promise you I'll have an episode up as soon as I can. Uh, my Guardian, my Guardian looks uh, really actually black. I think I'm with the black color scheme with my Guardian. But uh, looking pretty good. Nothing too crazy. Not, not fancy, beautiful armor or anything like that. I've mainly just been doing PvP. I think I'm still like level three or something in the main game and like my pvp levels going up but uh either way guys uh either way banjo joe thank you for that um you also mentioned um the uh, nice video and you read the se in the comments under yours that would be miguel uh miguel you left me yeah it's you you blame it on on your university assignments and and, and all that stuff but i thank you let's it's, it's a long read but it's a worthwhile read um you got a lot of really good information in there which is really cool uh, talking about how uh, you you just suggested the well. I kind of like the well. Uh, you give me some suggestions on how you have your necromancer built, uh, even though I don't have minions. So it's a little bit different. So a little bit different than uh, than what you got. Um, and uh, oh, you're also saying how you're surprised that they targeted um, uh, who they did with the oh, I can't remember his name right now. Uh, why can't I remember his name? The guy that just got shot with an arrow like last episode. Oh my gosh, I'm totally blanking. Oh, I'm so sorry. Ellie's Ellie's former uh, uh, boy toy. Um, Zot, Zot, Zot. Yeah, there we go. I'm sorry about I, my mind was totally blanking there for a second. Why he got shot when there were so many other targets there. Maybe he was just the target of opportunity. He was the only one facing the back to the guy. Maybe, I'm not sure why. Maybe maybe Zaitan just wanted us to, to hurt. Maybe he just wanted to, me personally to feel the emotional pain of, of losing him and Ellie maybe go crazy. Maybe she'd go crazy and, and, and maybe attack us or something like that. I don't know why why Zaitan targeted him, but he did and it was very sad. Silly Zaitan. We were able to take him out though, um, the, the archer there, so it uh, it was really good. Um, you're also saying how he was he was able to wear stuff that the engineers weren't able to wear until they we got the holosmith uh, elite spec, spec, which is kind of interesting. It was kind of cool. And uh, uh, so much other information in there. Thank you so much. Oh, you're also talking about how uh, how you died in the same vista I tried out before uh, you accidentally rolled off, which I've done before. Don't worry. I, I do that all the time. And how you're like, I shouldn't worry about not being very good at jumping puzzles because you're not very good at jumping puzzles. Thank you for that. Thank you. Thank you for letting me know I'm not the only one that's not very good at jumping puzzles because I, I try, but not, I'm not very good at them. Um, otherwise, that um, I noticed... When I was playing a little bit today, when I was getting ready to record, there's this little thing down here. Maybe we can add 
novelty items, which is really, 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 really cool. Um, which is pretty awesome. So, like, I went and, like, I actually bought from the uh, Black Lion Trading Company. I bought the little dragon emblem balloon because, I don't know, I thought it was kind of cool. Little, little uh, Guild Wars 2 logo. Uh, and that's what my... Uh, Ranger got, I think it was my Ranger, got like a little little box thing where I could pick a novelty. I didn't realize this was what it was. So you actually get to get to preview all the cool little novelties and stuff like that. I think some of them are only in the um, uh, Black Line Trading Company. I, I think um, you guys were commenting on that episode. I think I think Phonic, you're the one that did it. I can't remember who, who left the comment saying that the tonics are going to be part of this too, which is kind of cool. Uh, especially if someone's uh, planning on maybe doing a Coden uh, a Let's Play, like like a certain someone might be doing. But uh, I think it's kind of interesting. So you just have to like... Oh, apparently I'm under attack. Uh, you get like four different different ones to pick, or four different ones you can slot, and then you can kind of choose the ones uh, you want to use. I just want to take you down here and show you guys what I got. Come on, go down quicker. Go down quicker. There we go. Um, out of combat. So I picked... I'm, I'm, not, I'm not in combat. There we go. So I picked the, the Guild Wars 2 balloon. I think it's kind of cool. Uh, it does take it rid of all your uh, your abilities and stuff like that. So it's definitely something you can't use in combat. But look at that. It follows you like a little balloon. I think it's cool. I like it. Nothing will pop up too much. But uh, noticing you can maybe form a band and stuff like that. So I think that's kind of a cool little thing. Uh, makes it easier for people using those little novelties and whatnot. But that is that. Uh, let me know if you guys uh, got some favorite novelties you guys are using. Uh, stuff like that. Because I think some of them are pretty cool. Uh, I, like, I love the boombox ones. Boombox ones are, look awesome. You had a dancing ghost. Uh, the chair one looks kind of cool too. I mean, if it wasn't... I can't remember how, many, how much was it. I think it was the Black Line Train Company. I don't have any more gems anymore. Yeah, it's like 600 gems for that. I'm like, mm, a little pricey for that, but... You know, I had some extra gem gems lying around, so I just grabbed one of them just to see what it was going to do. Uh, either way, guys, let us continue with our mission. So I have the Against the Corruption, I have the Joining Expedition in Orr's Royal Tombs here, which is interesting. It shows this is where it is, but it doesn't have the little green dot. But either way, let's enter the instance here and get it going. So Against the Corruption. Of course, with their awesome and always amazing loading screens here. Okay, so let's meet Traherne here. Hey, Traherne. What do we got going on? Greetings, Commander. This is Havrun Gretchen, one of the spirit shamans of Holbrek. With her is Larenthir, War Master of the Vigil. You're an inspiration, Commander. Many believe that if we can defeat Zaitan, Jormag will be next. Your deeds bring great hope to the Norn. Silvari, sing of your victories, and even the Char raise battle cries in your honor. You've been a spark to many flames. It's my pleasure to meet you both. I hope today will bring another victory for Tyria. Marshal Traherne, what's our goal? I have created a ritual that might cleanse a dragon's corruption. If it succeeds, this mission could be a turning point in the war. My research suggests that the royal tombs were deeply sacred. They may still hold the connection I need to restore the land with Orr's fading life force. If the dragon discovers our attempt, he'll try to stop us. Havrun, you and Larenthir will defend the mouth of the tomb. Give us all the time you can. We will, Marshal Traherne. By the bear, I swear we'll hold the line or die trying. All right, so escort Traherne to the royal tombs here. Where are you, Traherne? There we go. Take out these preservers and stuff on the way. Um, I think um, Miguel, you were also saying how I should uh, try skipping enemies and stuff when I'm running to different areas. So what I did was I actually just ran to the start of this mission before I even started the recording. Uh, you're saying how like I can dodge out of the way, use different abilities to make myself go a little bit quicker. Uh, I did that. It uh, got so much quicker, which is awesome. With the 25% uh, boost with one of the, the uh, signets, I think. Which one was it? The Signet of Locust, I think. Yeah. Which is kind of nice. I would say it was nice because I had the Signet of Locust on and uh, the bonus from like switching from a low, low, uh, um, low populated instance. So I think I'd like, I think they combined up. So I had like 
40% speed increase, which is so quick. Oh my gosh, can't wait to get mounts to go even quicker. I know I could get mounts right away, but I decided I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna get mounts when I should have gotten mounts. I'm gonna get mounts when you guys played it from the start, uh, all got mounts. You guys, you guys had to go through this stuff without, without a mount, so. You know what I'm like? I'll do that too, don't worry. Ooh, ambush, not good, not good. Knock these guys down. And yeah, as much as I, I normally like having pets, I'm really liking uh, the Necromancer like this. I think it's kind of a, a fun set of abilities. If you guys have other abilities you think I should be using too, let me know uh, down below too. I love hearing your guys' suggestions. I like trying new builds. I haven't like settled on like this is exactly how I'm going to build. I've had some people asking like, oh, what kind of build do you have? I'm just throwing pieces to together to and hope it works. I don't have like a, a set plan yet. But uh, if you guys have some ideas, let me know down below. Let's go to the Royal Tombs. Is this the Royal Tombs over here? This must be it. A bunch of step aside. Get guards ready here. For a fight. All right, let's take these guys down. Spectral Guard. Well, let's just, let's just get them all into the battle. How about that? And then we can use our um, area of effect abilities on them. Whoop. Dodge out of the way. That one, you see that expert dodge? Thank you so much for teaching me stuff like that, guys. And reminding me to use stuff like that all the time. I have to drop my weapon here. Ooh. Oh my gosh, I'm totally forgetting about my shades, too. There we go. Another shade here. Get some barrier up. Get all the barriers up. Let's take down this risen abomination. You are down, good sir. I mean, I wouldn't really call you a good or a sir, but you're down. Return. This is Azabe Kabar. Gretchen, you and Larenthir must hold the entrance. Zaitan's forces will be relentless. Our survival is in your hands. I understand, Marshal Traherne, and I won't fail you. You'll have the time you need. Was it like her, like, bare looking on her arms and her armor? This is a bad time to be traveling. That's a really cool part of that armor. I mean, it's a little revealing, but I like the arms at least. Kind of the, the, the bear skin armor. Looks kind of cool. Alright. Down this uh, spectral skirmisher. What? Oh my gosh, and a risen spider behind me. Ooh, risen spiders are so gross looking. Why are you so gross, risen spiders? To do some real damage. I mean, I guess you're, you're spiders and you're undead. That makes you extra gross. But still. Where's Fern go? Fern? Is he just gonna stand there? Thanks, buddy. Thanks for the help, man. Leading from the rear. That's how you do it, right? <laughs> I'm joking. Traherne's actually a really good leader. I kind of I kind of like him as a boss. Some spider hatchings up here, too. Uh, drop him well. This barrier down here, too. There we go. Keep moving forward. Well, another little hatchling. Die, hatchlings, die. Oh, I guess it's a bigger one here, too. Traherne, are you coming to help, buddy? Come on. Come on, I think I can use these. If it's just me, too, I think I can use these on myself just normally without a shade. So if I get out of the range of the shade, get like F5. Like I still get the barrier, so I think I count. I count as one of them, right? Yeah. It's kind of good. Oh, maybe my allies don't get barrier from. Maybe it's just me that gets barrier from that. Oh, maybe I just get barrier from this one, and my allies get barrier from the other one. Okay. Okay, now I'm actually worried that she burns somewhere. Yeah, I'm a little worried about this. Traherne, are you actually, like, you stuck in a wall? Energy. I was just joking. Maybe you actually are stuck here. Oh my gosh, I think you are stuck in a wall. What's on your mind? There we go. There we go. Oh, I have to stay with you, Traherne. I got, I got a little too carried away and went too, too quick forward. 
Sorry, Traherne, I left you. That was my bad. My bad. I blamed it on you, but it was my bad. I gotta, I gotta be nicer, Traherne, here. Thank you. Now you're helping me, Traherne. I like this. Okay, I just want to test this. I put the shade down. No, Traherne, stay oh, in the shade. In the shade. If I cast that. Okay, yeah, Traherne didn't get the barrier from that. That's good to know. Okay, so that is just... I just get that barrier. Okay. But uh, the F3 skill... He gets the barrier from that. Okay. Just just doing some tests and figuring things out there, guys. Okay, what do we got going on here? Okay, that's, I'm like, oh, is that something from Zaitan? Nope. This is the place. We'll perform the ritual here. The All moment right. we begin... Zaitan will know. Be ready for anything. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's do this. Where is everybody? That's for defense Zaitan. Oh, got some losing corruptors. Drop some of my shades. My area attack abilities. I don't want to quite use all my abilities right now. Just in case more enemies show up. Go. Some more shades here. Shades do cripple. I think um, Miguel, you were mentioning how I should I should cripple the enemies as I head in the, head in the combat there. Titan Wraith. Uh, because, you know, I kind of, you know, I mainly stay in one place. If I crippled them, then they would, uh, or like chilled them, they'd kind of be stuck chasing me. Which is good. Whoop. Get out of that. Oh, you're a veteran too, aren't you? Oh, let's get some healing down. I need to get more shade stuff up. Uh, let's get more barrier myself. You're probably the big baddie, so I'll use my main ability there. Or my, uh... My... Big ability there. Oh, get out of that. You're down. Oh, no. There's more coming. Okay. I expect there to be more coming. Figured with a veteran showing up, that would be the big guy, but... I guess not. Drop some shades here. Drop some healing on Traherne, too. Whoa, and myself... Whoop, whoop, whoop. It's a healing. It's a barrier. Guys, well down. I think I can heal Traherne with that. Oh my gosh. What? What? Are you the one that I was just calling saying it looks really cool? Right. Oh man. Oh, this Traherne got his ritual done. Oh. Alright. What's the plan now, Traherne? No. We were so close. By the pale tree, it's impossible. All this, all these lives, wasted. All for nothing. Traherne, didn't you see? The cleansing worked. For a moment, the spirit of the land rose up like a breath of wind. We all felt it. It was as if Orr's own soul was fighting to be free. The ritual was a success. But the absolution didn't hold. Though sacred, the royal tombs weren't strong enough. This isn't the heart of Orr. I wonder if such a heart still exists. Wait, remember the vision that the Pale Tree gave us? An Orion King spoke of the Source. Maybe that's something that can help. You're right, the Source of Ore. Yes, I think I remember hearing about such a thing. A priestess of Grenth and a shaman of the Norn spoke of it. Those sound like solid leads. Which should I follow? That, my friend, I shall leave to you. 
two roads to the same goal, the cleansing of ore and eventually Zaitan's own demise. Uh-oh. Now we get to make decisions here. Um, let's see what Traherne has to say here. So, uh, you're right, Van Lessa. Uh, the pack stands between Tyria and Destruction. Uh, we cannot give up for a moment. I lost my faith. Uh, the ritual worked. We just need to find the source of ore. Um, agreed. And I know two ways to proceed. We could uh, appeal directly to the gods of ore, specifically Greneth, or we could recover a legendary magical map to guide us. Uh, how can Greneth help? Um... The ancient priests of Grenth were said to have to be the keepers of Or's deepest secrets. Uh, we'll find them in Or's Citadel of Silence. It's a terrifying place, half shrouded in the mist. Um, that's a good question. Is that? Yeah, that is the one I picked. The god I picked at the very start. So I think that's the one I'm going to pick for my necromancer here. But I'm going to ask about the legendary map first. So an ancient Norn explorer, uh, Rumke, uh, was trapped in Or while Zaitan rose beneath his ship. Uh, legend says his map was blessed by all four spirits of the wild and can uh, and can show the route to any destinations. Um, so where do we find the map? Uh, we'll have to risk to ask uh, Romke himself. His ghostly form is still trapped in ore, bound to the land that ended his journey and his life. Uh, you'll find him near uh, the sea there. So um, let's visit the Citadel. So let's do so that one. Close closer than ever before but we cannot give up hope my wild hunt is not in vain this is a challenge we can overcome you have my gratitude commander for all you've done all right so finish this mission oh we get a new uh new staff it's a two-handed staff um that one comes with healing power that one comes with precision what do I want? They're both about the same, and I'm not really going to use either one of them, so let's just grab one. Um, some crafting supplies and some bags of loot. I like bags of loot. Uh, let's see here. So let's accept that. Uh, we get that. It is much better than what I currently have, so let's just replace those quickly. Open those up. Crafting supplies and deposit all materials. Ooh. Unidenti unidentified dime, so winter mint die. Uh, I can't use that. Can't use that stuff, so it's just rid of it. Bloop, bloop, bloop. More luck. My luck does not go up. Okay, so now we gotta search the hidden vaults of Ors, Temple of Grinth. Um, you know what? Let's do it. Let's, uh, see if we can, uh, find it there. Where are we supposed to be heading to? The map button here for a second. Okay, we gotta keep traveling south here. Where am I right now? Oh, right here. It's actually a hero point right here. But I'm gonna grab this first because there's a waypoint there and everything like that. So that is a, uh, a good place to go there. What we should run? Cathedral of Silence. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue with this mission, guys. I'm gonna make this a little bit of a longer episode probably, but uh, I wanna, I wanna get, I wanna get, I wanna get into the, the Battle of Ore here. Oh, what are you doing, Mr. Risen Corruptor? I'm gonna take you down. Oh, thanks for coming to help. Oh my gosh. That looks really cool. Oh my, that looks really cool with the black... Like the wings like that and the, the, the black hound there. You really do like a reaper over there. That looks awesome. That is a cool color scheme. Let's head in here and let's grab that waypoint quickly. Talk with you and sell you my stuff. Sell junk. Uh, let's check how I'm doing for... Uh, not finishers, but that's all I want. I wanted training. Oh, I got none. So I'm not going to worry about that hero thing. Hero point. I'll do those later, guys. Whoop! Oh, boy. Almost uh, impaled myself on the ramparts there. Or on the walls there. I guess I wouldn't really be ramparts. Let's uh, continue this way. I'm going to switch you over for that ability to run a little bit quicker. 
I'm gonna run into an enemy. I'll try to. Gosh, there's so many people around here right now. I like this. Run into an enemy. I'll just um, jump into combat. Oh, oh, oh. Take that other wood log first, though. Not enough endurance. Not enough endurance. Knowledge grows. Ooh, the shipyard discovered. I like discovering things. Trident or spear. I like the look of the trident. Looks kind of cool. The map button here. Yep, just got to keep going straight from here. Whoa! That is huge. Whatever that is right there. Risen Claw? Big that thing is. I mean, we've seen little little ones. Oh, it's firing stuff at at us. Okay. Gosh, that was huge. Okay, we got some ice elementals over here. Some risen knights. Hope they can find the right way here. I'm going the right way. I have no idea if I'm going the right way. <laughs> Oh, maybe I can jump through this. It looks like I can. Also, it looks like I totally did not go the right way, so I have to turn around and come back this way. Yeah, come back up that way. To the Citadel of Silence. Okay, let's jump out of the way there. Um, is there any, I think you were mentioning horn skills or dagger skills that make me go quicker. Maybe not. Oh, but I can immobilize them. Yeah, that's what you meant there. Okay, let's continue on here. Get past this huge risen claw thingy. Oh, there's a couple of them. Ooh, what's that? Oh, we got a gun? Packed lightning cannon? Cool. I'm trying to run past you, though. If only I had an invisibility spell, I'd use that. But I don't. Ooh, skull. Prior fighting, fighting these guys like crazy. Good job, guys. Good jobs. Ice elementals. Good job. Or fighting those ice elementals. Not not the ice elemental. Good job. Fighting the ice elemental. It's a good job. Not enough energy. All right. So let's hop into this mission here. And reach your hand to the Citadel of Silence. Ooh. Ooh, this is gonna... I, I, I picture this being a cool-looking map. Uh, this temple must map. have been magnificent. It's painful to see it so ruined. Its foundations were shaken by the destruction of war, but it's still standing. Good work, Beck. Of course its foundations were good. That's where they put the tombs. Lead the way, Commander. Welcome, Commander. I've asked Priestess Rai to join us. Her knowledge of the God of Death is unmatched. I never thought I'd be standing here. The Cathedral of Silence, the first temple of Granthenteria. This is the Shrine of the Seven Reapers. Who were the Seven Reapers? Priests of Granth? Mortal heroes that fought beside Granth when he defeated the God Doom and ascended to the throne of death. They became his avatars. I can still feel the altar's sanctity. The secrets you seek are here. But Orion rites were very different. I may not be able to call the Temple Guardian. Don't worry. Where faith ends, science begins. This is my Voed. That's very old energy detector to you, non-geniuses. At this setting, it triggers old emotional resonance. Visions of the past. When we get to the altar, We'll watch the image residue of the Orions and see what they did. Excellent. Follow me then, and we'll find that altar. You look, uh, you look very familiar there, uh, Priestess, uh, uh, right? You look very, very familiar. A little, little taller, but, uh, very familiar, that's for sure. But, uh, let's, uh, get in here and secure the altar of, uh, Grint. Maybe, maybe we were sisters. Cousins. Twins, I don't know. <laughs> they look very similar. What's that way? That is the way I want to go. Okay, good. 
Whoop, risen spiders. You're even a necromancer too, aren't you? Well, they're using like lightning spells, okay. Not quite what I was expecting, but cool, cool, cool. Expecting maybe some minions or something like that. I mean, you look like a necromancer. Maybe you're not actually a necromancer. I just like shot the shoulder pads and stuff. Maybe, maybe she was one, but uh, I guess not. I guess not. All right, so let's uh, keep heading inside here. Does look pretty awesome in here. Let's keep going straight. A risen jester. I want to see what that risen jester is going to look like. First, I've got a spider to take out. Mwaha! And walk away from me. Don't you walk away from me, spider. Oh, i got to switch my weapon. My abilities up here. Oh, oh, nope. They're attacking me. There's the jester. Oh, the jester looks kind of cool. A little hat there and stuff like that. Uh, acolyte, servant, wizard. Let's uh, get healing well down on me. Some more shades on the enemies here. Take them down on this side first. Uh, let's get some barriers up on my allies there too. You guys are down. Awesome. Thanks for her. With your awesome, amazing sword there. Got that. Now I'm gonna turn on these guys. Time to do some more. Barrier there, some more damage on you. You're down, and there's one more over here. Yes, yes. Oh, there's two more over here, okay. Even better. Oh, oh we got those spiders involved also. Oh my gosh, what are you, Risen Spider Queen? Okay, I didn't see you coming. That's good, that's good. Turn her down on me. Come on, fall you Spider Queen. barrier here too. Bend them a little bit. I took her down before she lays too many eggs for the little uh, hatchlings. Okay, the hatchlings are all gone now too. Another acolyte here. You guys doing okay over there? Oh, nope. We lost a couple allies. Let's uh, try to revive you and I get a well here to do some uh, healing for everybody else too. Which is nice. Priestess was down, and those little raptors down too. Oh, I thought I got the priestess up. Let's go finish that off. There we go. You're back up. Get this raptor back up. So many undead all at once here. Not what I like to see. Okay, you're back up. You're good. Some uh, barrier there. All right. Oh, Traherne, you need some healing right quick. Can't let Traherne fall. Go. So, like, come on, Traherne, run into my circle here so you can get some healing. Or not. Or not. So tired. There we go. Alright, is everyone up now? Everyone's up. Let's see those. Oh, what are you? Let's switch that ability out first uh, for that one. Like for everyone to get everyone's all healed up. Okay, good. Let's take out this veteran risen knight. Okay. Get out of the 
fire. Oh, you're kind of resting there for a second. Oh yeah, you reflect projectiles too. That's not good. Oh, I switched weapons. Didn't mean to do that. Oh well. There you go. You're down. Okay, let's do this. Let's watch the residence thingy work. Look, they're performing the ritual. Where? Oh, there they are. Okay. Oh, okay. So he's using the device that lets us see them. They plan to sear our nation as they did Ascalon. Vizier Kilbron says he can defeat them, but we must prepare for the worst. As Desmina did so many years ago, we shall call upon Grint for his aid. If War dies, at least we will be with him. Where is the god to whom I give my undying devotion? Where is the god to whom I may beg revenge against those who scorn me? In order to commune with the altar, we should mimic them. Everyone to your places. Um, is this my place? Where is the god to whom I may give my undying devotion? Where is the god to whom I may beg revenge against those who scorn me? Follow where I lead. Come whence I call. And the corpses of the dead will be yours to control. Cool. It's an avatar of Greneth here. Let's speak with the Reaper. Hail, ancient one. Rise from your frozen tomb. I, your priestess, call upon you in the name of Greneth himself. Who dares summon me? A true priest? Is there such a thing in this fallen land? I am Grenth's servant, and we have survived many dangers to speak with you. Please, hear us. I see in your heart that you are no stranger to death. Very well. I will hear you out. But in return, you will kill in Grenth's name. The keeper of this shrine has fallen to Zaitan. Grenth wishes him returned, but I am too weak to perform the task. Destroy the Keeper, and I will answer your questions. Thank you, Dark Reaper. We will do as you have asked. Destroy the corruption. Return the soul of the Keeper. Go. Alright, that was awesome. That was actually really, really cool. I like that. So, find the corruption... Corrupted Priest of Grint, which is right across from us. Awesome. Oh, we got some more Risen over here. A whole bunch of Risen over here. With noble squire, or squires and, and, and wizards and stuff. All right, this will be fun. All three of them? Oh, no, you jumped too quick. Let's jump out of that one. Are you guys going to help me? Just a little bit? There we go. Thanks for the help, guys. That's what, I, that's what I like. Teamwork. Teamwork. To oh, I totally, totally did that in the wrong direction. Actually, I think he got pushed into it, which is awesome. Alright, we got a wizard here. Let's uh, knock you down with my five skill here. Yeah, I love that skill. Okay, you are down. Getting pushed around like crazy. I like that. Time to do some weird things. Burning on you too. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, we got this. Take them on a little bit of the time, not all at once, a couple at a time. It'll make things a lot easier. There we go. Now you're coming. Oh, both of them are coming. Okay, good. Red glowing snorkel, that's never a good time. And yeah, I think after this mission, there's two more? I think there's one regular one, and then the final mission, I believe, 
I was, just, I was doing some reading just on the mission names, just, just on the, the quest chain. Um, to make sure I didn't get to the final one first. I'm trying to remember. I think there was one or two um, missions after this, because this, I think this is the last branching one. And then after that, I'm going to I'm gonna remember to double check it again, because I want to make sure my... Um, my ranger. I do the the opposite mission that I was gonna do with my that I did with my necromancer with my ranger to make sure make sure we're not all seeing the same stuff every time. I'll see what I do with my I'm trying to decide what I what I'm gonna do with my char when I get that far. So I kind of want to go through. Um, kind of see this like I want my char to go through these missions up here like these territories up here that I haven't been through and like this one's a level. 80. It's got some 80 stuff up here, so I don't know. Don't quite know what's going on with that, but we'll make it work. Take down this cool looking jester. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Love your hat there, jester. <laughs> look at you. You look so much. You look like you're just having fun. Right? Yeah, cool looking boots. I got a spider here too. A couple spiders, a couple more risen over here. That spider didn't like what we were doing. Time to do some real damage. Ooh, all the spiders are coming at us now. Light them on fire then. Uh, we got a new place here, bird archives. Ooh, we've almost uh, got another point here. Now, how does this work? I'm gonna go. I'll figure that out later when it, gets, when it gets up there. I think that gives me more experience when uh, crafting, right? Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, oh. We got those guys. What is that actually? I go to Masteries. So essentially, productive downtime. If I fill this bar, I learn this, right? Oh no, I still have to use Mastery Points to, to master it. So I learn it, but I have to master it, right? And then I'd go up to supply and line management, and then use three for that. And then, okay, cool. Still trying to figure out the mastery thing, guys. I haven't, I haven't quite mastered the mastery system yet. Still working on it. Still working on it. I think I just have the one ability right now, Pact Mentor, so I can become a, uh, a mentor. I have a mentoring badge I can use if I wanted to. But I don't want to. <laughs> I'm definitely no mentor yet. Mentor yet. Um, Time to do some real damage. All right. Take these guys. Keep taking these guys down. Oh, we got the keeper of the shrine here. You must be the one we need to take out, right? Got some healing here. Oh boy! Oh, thank goodness I'm not I'm not hanging out in any of those areas. Okay, let's uh drop that on you. Drop one over here. And uh get some damage on you. How about that? How about that? You like that? You like that damage? <laughs> keep the shrine and Yeah, keep the shrines when we need to take out. Oh, got a shade here. Actually, I'll probably take out your shade. Should take you down. There we go. Oh, we got the Reaper here to talk to. Oh, no, we still have the shade to take out. Okay. Come on, guys, we got this. There we go. Shade down. Let's talk with the Avatar of Grint. We've done it. Praise Grin. Praise the eternal alchemy, you mean? It was my device that summoned that creepy guy in the first place. We've fulfilled our part of the bargain, Reaper. Will you honor yours? So shall it be. You seek the heart of war, then you must go to the very beginning. The rock where the gods first set foot upon this world. There is an artesian well hidden in the mountains behind the temple of Melandru. There, 
you will find the place where Or began. Thank you. We'll go there and cleanse this land of the dragon's corruption. Or will once again be free. Let it be so. I will see you again, heroes. In every swing of your enemy's blade, I will be there. All right, mission completed. Ooh, let's see. Um, you don't really have much for me. Uh, let's get unlocked. Let's get unlocked. Let's get unlocked. Well, let's grab this one because it's unlocked. Or sorry, it's locked. Let's grab that. So let's accept that. Skin locked. Unlocked or skin unlocked. Blah, blah, blah. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so it just adds like oh, there's a tiny little piece on the shoulder. I like that. Like that again. Keep a little sh sash there. All right. Um, let's just get rid of the stuff. And deposit all materials. Bloop, 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 bloop. Oh, it's a salvage item. Let's use it then. There we go. Awesome, guys. So that is that. Let's exit this area here. Ooh. Place where the six gods first walked upon Tyria. I never dreamt I'd see it. Yet now we know it is the end of our great journey. Your wild hunt is nearly complete, my friend. How do you feel? Uh, to be honest, terrified. What will we find there? What if we fail? So many things can go wrong. Uh, this is the moment of destiny, Traherne. We'll face it together. Uh, you, you've always been such a good friend, Van Lessa. Thank you. Um, uh, this is... This was the place the gods first walked. Uh, Human Myth says that there were six gods. That when the six gods came to Tyria, they built the city of Ara. The source must be the place where they first set put on, put on Tyria. Uh, a place so powerful that it drew the attention of the gods from deep in the mist it must be amazing uh, no matter what your our personal beliefs the source of ore might be the only thing powerful enough to cleanse ore uh, we must go there and see for ourselves agreed all right so let's exit here back to the cursed shore with this awesome looking crazy guy i want to fight and see where we need to head next oh we gotta head back over here guys so that's where we're gonna be heading next let's just uh, teleport over here and I want to thank you guys so much for putting up with my little bit of a longer episode. Uh, what mission do we have here? This is the Source of Ores. So seek the Source of Ores water to cleanse the land. So I'm going to travel to the Artesian water. So that is the plan for next episode, guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget, if you guys like to see it, that like, subscribe button. If you guys don't like to see it, you can hit that dislike button too. Um, also, I, I want to see as many as you guys uh, on Saturday because I've got some, I got something planned for Saturday this week that I want to get your guys' input on. Uh, something for, not, not to, like, really the future of the channel, but for uh, a future series I have planned for the channel. Um, so if you guys would love to, to join me, uh, I'm going to be playing on um, Saturday about 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Uh, if you guys can't make it, that's totally, totally fine. Um, I'll, I'll probably be jumping in uh, another time uh, next week also uh, to maybe get some input from you guys. If you guys can't make it in game, uh, I will be in the Discord channel just chat with you guys too, uh, sending out some stuff that way. Um, even even if you guys can't can't hear me, I can I can do some tech stuff too. But uh, I have some plans for for the channel, some some ideas coming up, and I'm gonna need your guys' ideas or might need your guys' help, not ideas. Might need you guys' help with it. Uh, I'm still relatively new to Guild Wars. I don't want to don't want to give away the surprise yet, but uh, um, if you guys can hopefully join me Saturday at uh, 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, uh, that would be super super awesome. Uh, even if you can't make it, uh, if you're on the American servers, so I'm currently playing on the EU servers, uh, we can at least still talk uh, in game uh, and stuff like that, uh, or in the Discord channel. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode, though, guys, and I will see you guys next time. And don't forget, until then, keep your stick on the ice.